back to Blind Grilling. I am the most interesting griller in the world and your host, Chris Peltz. And on this episode, we're going to be having fun making some brisket stuffed potato bombs. Yeah, yeah, I'm here. The one who's got that master flow. Lower smoke from local to international. Yeah, I'm him. Yeah, I'm him. What we have here are some red potatoes and we've got a, a couple of them already cored out but I wanted to show you what we're doing. The tool that I'm using for those who cannot see I would almost describe it uh, like it's a core right uh, so for coring apples for coring other things but it doesn't slice them it's just for getting the core out it almost feels like a shoehorn with a ring on one end which is where you start to do the core. So we're going to core this little red potato. And these potatoes are uh, you know, you're not maybe not quite the size of a baseball, but that's kind of what we were going for is about baseball size. We're going to take this core and we're just going to run it. Whoop. Get it. There we go. Straight down. Sweet. And we have a hole all the way through our potato. Don't discard uh, the center because what we're going to do is we're going to use that to cap the holes after we stuff these potatoes with brisket and cheese, wrap them in bacon, and throw them on the grill. Man, I can't wait. These are going to be awesome. So we've got our potatoes cored out. We've got a little bit of cream cheese. We've got some uh, sharp cheddar and white cheddar kind of mixed together and we've got some brisket. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take, like put this cream cheese in that hole right there, we're gonna take some brisket, we're gonna shove it in the hole of this potato on both ends, looky there, right? Oh wow, now we're gonna take some cheese, we're gonna stuff our cheese, cheddar cheese, we'll go to the other end, just a few little pieces. We're gonna get that all stuffed in there. I don't mind if it hangs out a little bit. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab one of our, the cores that we drilled out, <laughs> sort of, of the uh, potato. We're gonna cut the cap, the each end off, and that's gonna be the cap of our potato bomb. Shove that in there. We're gonna finish stuffing these. Woo. And then we'll be back in a minute to wrap them in bacon. So we're done stuffing our potatoes, and so now we've taken a piece of bacon, and we're going to wrap this piece of bacon. Wow, that's a thick piece of bacon, too. They're around our potato. Ooh, I might have to cut that in half. So we're going to cut this piece of bacon. Then we're gonna wrap it. Oh yeah, looky there. All right, so we got our potato wrapped, stuffed with brisket, cream cheese, cheddar cheese, capped off and wrapped in bacon, and we're getting ready to throw them on the big green egg. We're out at the big green egg. Flame Boss has got us setting right at 350 degrees. Um, we could probably do these a little hotter at 400, um, but I don't wanna burn up my pit probe right now. and. Uh, I am going to put whoo, smoky put these potatoes on the grill whoo, smoky and we'll be back in about an hour to check on them it's been about 35 minutes so we're going to open up our egg and we're going to find these little potato bombs. We're going to rotate them just like that. Start doing all of these. Woohoo! And then we'll check them in about another 20 to 30 minutes. Folks, we're about to take these uh, potato bombs off of the grill. Just wanted to kind of show you. We'll get them inside and cut into them, but 
Man, they smell amazing. The bacon is done. I probed them, they probed tender. It's been right at an hour at 350 degrees and mm, can't wait to get these off. I'm gonna get my gloves on, get them off, and uh, we'll cut into them in just a few minutes. Folks, we are here with Michelle Borland and um, a regular guest of ours uh, here at the house anyway. And we have made these potato bombs kind of as a, um, uh, a little surprise for her. So I'm uh, going to have you cut into it. Okay. And let us know. Oh my, look at all that. Turn it off, Dad. Nope. Is that brisket in there? It's brisket, a little bit of cream cheese, and some cheddar cheese. And wrapped in bacon. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well worth it? No stuff. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Mm -hmm. All right, folks. Hey, everybody. If you like this video, you want to see more like it, hit that subscribe button. Uh, we'll be doing a lot more videos, uh, with different things to cook, lots of tools and techniques and things like that. Uh, leave a comment. We'd love to hear from you. And as always, remember, if you're looking, you ain't cooking. Yeah.